Hey everyone, Matthew Drake here with Baja Designs. I want to show you how to install a uh, Peterson Manufacturing LED headlight. It's a quick, simple retrofit, and so I'm going to show you uh, very quickly on how to do that. First thing, uh, if you've never changed your headlights, you're going to need to do is you're going to need to take out these clips to remove your grill. And these clips are located up on the top portion of your grill. Very simple to do. You just get yourself a flathead screwdriver and you just pop those things up and there's uh, there's about five or six of them up along the top part of your grill and you're going to remove your grill. Once your grill is removed, then what we're going to do is we're going to need to remove the beauty ring or the trim ring, whatever you want to call it. Uh, there's four screws on each side and that is with a Torx 15 screwdriver. A T15 Torx screwdriver to remove those guys and your factory light uh, will come right out once you remove all four of those screws. And then just take your beauty ring aside, set it aside because you're going to put it right back on in just a few minutes. And then what we're going to show you here is there's two ways to take your factory light off. The first is you spin that out, but then your halogen is exposed. So I wouldn't recommend doing that. I'd just leave it right in there. You're going to slide this red part of the lever back and forth. Then you're just going to push this button down. And when you slid that forward and you push it forward, sometimes you've got to get yourself a good grip on it. But once you've done that, it slides right off. Okay, so we're going to set that out of the way. And then we're going to grab our Peterson LED headlamp. And you'll notice it says top on one and there's a PM on the bottom. So we're going to do that. Now this comes factory, ready to plug right into a TJ uh, or uh, any uh, vehicle with a three-prong setup. Being that we are working on a JK, uh, we've got a uh, modulator that will get rid of the flicker, an anti-flicker. And then we also want to be able to plug into the harness uh, for the JK. So I recommend plugging into this harness uh, vehicle part of the harness first. And what you're going to find is that slides in, but it doesn't snap real good. So what I want you to do is go in and push right up against the frame and you'll hear just a little tiny snap. Then you know you're done. Slide your red uh, locking mechanism back. And we're just going to come in here and we're going to just a normal connection there. All right and then route your uh, connectors out of the way and then just push that bad boy right up in there and there are uh, tabs so that your headlight will go in only in, in one orientation and once you find that orientation you're going to grab your beauty ring it also you have to spin it around to find the right orientation because there's only uh, a few directions that that will melt Take your screws, put them back in. And ladies and gentlemen, I am uh, very much not a mechanic. I don't know if you can tell that or not. Um, it should be pretty easy. I'm kind of a backyard mechanic kind of guy. I don't really have a lot of mechanical skills. Not that great at turning a wrench. But I wanted to video this because I wanted you to understand how simple it really is to change your headlights out uh, to the Peterson LED headlamps. Now this is a uh, what's called the 701C and of course as I mentioned I have the anti-flicker uh, pigtail to be able to mount onto the JK and essentially four screws and we are finished and I'll just leave a couple of them there to hold it on let me turn them on real quick I'll show you what those look like this will be your low beam and uh, on the low beam the upper portion illuminates and on the high beam the entire um, beam uh, illuminates for both a high and a low function and then you can see both of them I've already changed the other side very nice pattern uh, very even and a very attractive, easy, complete 
genuine retrofit. And when I say genuine, I mean it's genuinely a drop-in replacement. A lot of the others, the pigtails uh, don't match up right. You have to really uh, ham around with it a lot. And um, it's just a bunch of work. So last thing we've got left to do is just put the grill back on. And uh, we are done. Literally, you should be able to change your headlights out within about 15 to 20 minutes with the Peterson 701C LED headlights. If you need any help, please give me a call. I'd love to help you in any way I can. My number should be in the post. Thank you very much, and God richly bless you. Again, this will go on a uh, brand new uh, TJ. So feel free to call me, uh, the originator of the post, or you're welcome to contact Peterson Manufacturing. Just let them know that you heard it from Matthew at Baja Designs. Thank you, and God bless you.